Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to show you how we make our roast potatoes, oil free. We show this all the time on our Snapchat and Instagram stories and we've had so many requests for the recipe. First up, we always enjoy our oven baked white potatoes with some oven baked sweet potatoes as well. And we just put these whole in the oven. As you can see here, that's it. We're setting the oven at 250 degrees Celsius, which is 480 degrees Fahrenheit. Don't worry about the timer for now. Next step, grab your potato peeler. Can't do it without it. You can't use your fingernails, that's for sure. <laughs> Start peeling your white potatoes. Once your spuds are peeled, time to wash them. And before you ask in the comments, yes, that's a fake plant. No, we didn't buy it. It came with the kitchen. But hey, it looks pretty. All right, so time to cut those potatoes up. Now you can cut them in a variety of different sizes and shapes. You could do cubes. Uh, we're gonna do kind of like wedges, would you say? Yeah. Once your potatoes are chopped, put them in a pot and cover them with water. Place the pot on the stove and boil the potatoes. They say every pot has a lid. This one didn't come with one, so we're using a fry pan turned upside down. Okay, this is the key part to making these potatoes. You want them boiled, but you don't want them mushy. So you do have to keep an eye on them and kind of get it Goldilocks. Just, you know, a little bit breaking up, but not too much. Cooking time is going to vary depending on the temperature that you've set your stove top to. Once they're done, strain the water. Transfer them to a bowl and now we're going to season them. Now we usually just season our potatoes with one seasoning flavor, but on our social media, we've been showing two different seasoning uh, combination combinations. Yes. So you're <laughs> gonna get two for one in this video. Option one has garlic powder. Mixed herbs, which include thyme, rosemary, marjoram, basil, oregano, and sage. Paprika. Parsley leaves. Chopped chives. Then it's time to stir through the seasonings and make sure that all the potatoes are coated well. Now this is where it's important that you don't overboil your potatoes because they will fall apart drastically during this stirring process. So a little bit of mush on the outside is okay, but you don't want it to become like mashed potato. Seasoning option number two, again, garlic powder, paprika, curry powder, turmeric, a pinch of cumin, parsley leaves again, and the chives. Line your baking tray and transfer the potatoes. Be sure to spread them out so that they cook evenly. And what we do is gather any of the herbs or the seasoning that's fallen off the potatoes that's left in the mixing bowl and we just put them on top and kind of pat that down because it crisps up and it's really yummy. Pop them in the oven. You can see there the sweet potatoes are coming along nicely. Sometimes we leave the temperature on 250 Celsius, which is 480 Fahrenheit. Today we've turned it down to 200 Celsius, which is 390 Fahrenheit. Now, temperatures and cooking times are going to vary depending on the strength and quality of your oven. So just keep an eye on them and they're cooked when they start to crisp up on the outside and look a little golden. Be sure not to let them burn. Some varieties of potatoes will crisp up better than others. These weren't the best, so try a few different varieties and see what works for you. And no, we don't know what variety of potato we use. We just buy the cheapest white potatoes we can find at the market and they're not labeled. This was seasoning option one. And this is seasoning option number two, the curry flavor. They're obviously a lot more yellow because of the turmeric and both taste different and they're equally delicious. Absolutely. And we're serving them with the sweet potatoes and some fresh veg. Hope you enjoyed this recipe. As always, try it out, share it around. We wanna hear all about it. Make sure you send us a picture on Instagram and tag us. And yes, eating potatoes makes you stronger. <laughs> we absolutely love this meal, guys. We never get sick of it. If you guys have any different seasoning combinations that you enjoy, leave them in the comments below. We'd love to read them, as would others. Absolutely. And yeah, let's see how many potatoes I can fit in my mouth at once. Awesome. You'd be surprised, guys. <laughs> oh. <laughs>
And of course the video or this meal would not be complete without a happy potato dance. Here comes that carb high. So make sure you enjoy this meal, do a little potato happy dance in your living room and uh, thanks for watching. Like, share, comment, subscribe and remember until next time that going vegan is not the most we can do. It's the least we can do and it's super delicious. See you next video. Bye guys.